For years now, Americans have relied on fast food, often delivered right to their cars, to fuel their busy lifestyles. These restaurants are not going away, but some of the workers they depend on are. In the United States right now, there's a shortage of 800,000 positions within the fast food industry. Welcome to Good Time. Good Times Burgers, a Colorado-based fast food chain, has found a way to address the problem. An automated order taker at one of its stores has started handling drive through traffic at breakfast. We're trying to be the absolute best company in the world for conversational AI ordering in fast food. Rob Carpenter founded Valiant AI, the creator of an artificial intelligence system he claims is the first of its kind in the world. A pavement sensor recognizes a car pulling up. And we greet the customer and we say, Welcome to Good Time. The Thank customer will say something like, I want a cheeseburger. We grab that audio, we send it up to our AI algorithm, which translates it to text. We then insert that cheeseburger into the point of sale system so that when someone pulls up, they can pay. Employees focus on filling the order. A third of their workload has been taken off their plate. It's an example of how new technology could potentially transform the fast food industry by reducing the pressure on workers and filling the labor gaps that exist right now. Some restaurants already use robots for some tasks. Self-service kiosks have popped up to help customers order. And the new web platform employ.com matches workers with open restaurant shifts. Technology, if we do it correctly, especially, it could help enhance us and really free us from doing monotonous work to do more creative and how do we make this better and more efficient. All of this emerging technology that we're creating is giving us the tools of creation. It gives us the ability to create far more interesting new tools for doing things. Futurist Thomas Fry says it'll take a while for AI to crack the restaurant labor shortage. Carpenter points out that language-related bugs in the system are still being ironed out. We joke that it's like been frustrating because I want a burger. Okay, I've added a burger to your order. Seems really simple until you start digging in under the surface and it's extremely complicated. But he says wait times in this lane have been cut 10 to 25%. Lunch and dinner AI service is coming soon at good times. Just 2% of all customers now ask to talk to a human. As long as they get their food and it's accurate, they don't really mind. Thank you. Even if their interaction with their order taker. You're welcome. Remain a little bit off. Hendrick Sabrandi, CGTN, Denver.